Windows 11 has a lot of new visual elements to it. Probably the most prominent one is the File Explorer or Windows Explorer as it's called. The menus and icons are totally different and the folder structure is also a little different. Some people like myself don't mind it. In fact, I think it's a pretty welcome change to a pretty dated look. But others don't really like it so much. So here's a way by which you can revert some of the menus back to a typical Windows 10 style explorer. Just like most of the edits we have done on the channel, this will also be a registry edit. So search for registry editor from the start menu and click on it. Navigate to this particular path which I will leave in the description. You can simply copy paste it in the address bar. Right click on the shell extensions folder and create a new key. Name it as blocked. On the right side window of that key, right click and select a new string value. And then copy this weird looking value from the description and paste it there. Once that is done, simply close the registry editor and restart your system. You could also just kill the Windows Explorer from the task manager and restart it. And there you have it, as soon as you open the Windows Explorer or file manager, you will see some of the older options in the, uh, the menu bar. Yes, I know, I know, the icons still look the same as Windows 11 and I wasn't really impressed by that either. The main thing that I wanted to check, which one of you asked, is if we could still get back the thumbnail preview for individual folders. Microsoft had quietly removed that option when they first rolled out a Windows 11 inside a preview and looks like it's still not here. Even with this registry change, I couldn't see an option or a way to get the preview of an individual folder the way we used to do in Windows 10. Now again, I personally don't mind it, but I know that some of you really like to use it because it gives you a sneak peek or a preview of what's inside the folder. But you can still get that option to preview that image uh, from a bunch of image files that are in a folder. All you have to do is go to the view tab and go to options and make sure that this first option is unselected. It basically makes the images show up as thumbnails instead of just icons. You can change the list view from small to large icons so you can see what's in the image file even before you open it. I mean that feature should be enabled by default but in case it was reset when you uh, change the registry, you can enable it back like this. I'll keep looking for a way to get the folder preview working in Windows 11 but until then, well, this is the best we can get. You get the top menu bar and a few other options from Windows 10 with the Windows 11 iconography on it. Another way to easily customize your explorer is to try a third party option. This one is simply called Files. It's a community software that has been developed to look very similar like your stock Windows Explorer but has a lot of new features in it. It allows for some pretty great features like integration with your cloud and even have a separate tab for multitasking. So you can open two folders or even the same folder in two tabs if you want to move things around them. Now I downloaded it and played around with it for a while and yeah it does work pretty well. My only complaint with it is that it's very slow to start up. In the sense when you first launch the software it takes a while to load the side elements whereas the built-in explorer just opens with everything preloaded. Now of course I understand that nothing works as seamless as something that's built in but you know it's a fun thing to try out besides it has a lot of colorful themes that you can install it may not be the be all end all solution for everyone at least not for me but it's fun to try out so head over to files.community link is in the description or you could directly download it from the microsoft app store on your windows pc the last and possibly the most effective way in this list is using start all back a software suite that claims to be from a better timeline of windows 11 there is a paid version for this as well, but you can do a lot with just the free version. It allows you to change three things, the start menu, the taskbar and of course the file explorer. As soon as you install it, you'll notice that all of your icons will move to the left side and the start menu itself will change. You can enable and disable different views for your file explorer. You can even have a Windows 7 view for your system if you want. I know there are some of you who are diehard fans of Windows 7, so you can still have your icon packs back. And this also helps you bring back the old context menu without having to change anything in the registry. So that's another method. I love how responsive everything is. It all changes with just one click. It doesn't keep you waiting like the files.community software. Of course, you may have to relaunch the explorer if it is open, but you will immediately see the changes and it's the stock explorer itself so it doesn't have to be a separate app. I mean personally I am comfortable opening the registry and doing some changes myself instead of downloading a separate app to do that but this definitely offers a lot more customization than I could do in the registry. And since it is so fast and easy to use I think it will be a go to choice for many people. So yeah go ahead I recommend you use start all back. You can now enjoy nostalgia even when you are using the latest Windows 11 build. Oh and by the way if you are wondering how to install Windows 11 on your rather unsupported PC I have already made a video on that you can check it out. If you know of any better methods then you can leave them in the comments or you can join us on discord for more conversations like this.